Hey YouTubers, this is Rhonda. What's going on? So um, today I went to my favorite place. Well, not my favorite place. Like Mac is kind of like my favorite makeup place. And uh, no, the Makeup Forever um, section in Vegas at the Palazzo. No, that is my favorite. But I went to Sephora today and I got some really cool items. So I'm going to do kind of like my uh, MLK haul. That's what I'll call it. So I finally got, um, this is probably a lot, the Naked Lovely Little Naked Palette. Now I, you know, people talk about the Naked Palette for a while now. And I just was like, ugh, the colors are boring. Like, it's brown, it's beige. But, you know, it's really, I've seen some people do some really cool things. And for makeup artists who are looking to do weddings, this is probably, like, the top eyeshadow palette that people use. So, what I'm actually going to do is, um, this week I'll do another video of me doing, like, um, a bridal look using the Naked, naked Palette. So, that should be cool because this will be the first time that I'm using it. And you guys will get to see kind of what I do but this was I believe $48 um, it comes with uh, 12 eyeshadows um, you also get a shadow brush and um, a little bit of the eyeshadow potion a lot of people love their potion I just don't like the fact that it's difficult to get it out of the tube you have to crack the tube to get it out my thing is that's just too much um, typically what I'll use actually for a primer that I really like if it's not um, Max Painterly Paint Pot, I will use um, NYX um, NYX. NYX, hopefully you can see it. Um, NYX NYX, and they have this eyeshadow base, and it's ESB uh, 01, so it's white. It's like a white base, and I'll use this, and it'll make like colors pop anything. Love it. And it's cheap. It's only like $4. And you can get it at Ulta. Or also they have um, the NYX. And it's called the Milk Pencil. It's really cheap as well. I think it's like $4 as well. And it's white. And you just blend it in. And, and that's what I use as a base. I'd much rather do that than pay like 18 bucks for um, a shadow base. Some people like it. Um, I don't have an oily eyelid. So I don't really experience a lot of creasing. So I mean if you experience a lot of creasing then you may want to use that but I like the primers that I have and I don't really see the purpose of purchasing more to each their own so I got the naked palette um some other things items that I got now I've walked past um this like two three times because it is kind of expensive and you know I started off being with strictly MAC shadows and then slowly but surely kind of moved towards makeup forever shadows and, you know, then my friend told me to try NARS. Now, the only problem with NARS is NARS is really, really, really expensive. But they have some really amazing colors. And so, you know, when I see some cool colors, I will make, uh, you know, I'll make an exception. Ex I guess whatever. I'll make an exception. Ex ex freaking exception anyway and I'll purchase that but like I mean $23 for some eyeshadow is really really expensive to me so I'm it's really got to be a color that's worth it so I won't be spending 23 for some brown and beige hence what we got over here so but NARS has some really cool products love the blush the orgasm blush is the bomb so um this is the color that I got it's a little brown it's called night clubbing and I thought it was fab because it looks like it's a little um, like an espresso color but it has a shimmer to it so I'm gonna use my brush so you can see the color so yeah I mean it looks a little brown but I like it because it really has some shimmer in it and it's got like some gold flecks so I think that's pretty fab you know to using your crease for a smoke yeah I think that's gonna be really hot so that's my night clubbing I guess that's why they call it night clubbing because you'll be using it at the nightclub but um I love it because it's really pigmented and um really good color I mean black you really can't go bad with a matte for black um I typically will use carbon but Urban Decay has some really cool colors and you know you can't go wrong with a shimmery black you can always use it in a crease you don't have to use it you know for eyeliner or whatever you can do whatever the heck you want makeup there are no rules 
Well, there are, but whatever. You don't mind looking like a hot mess. It's on you. So, and then the second one I got was Tropic. So, I, I'm i like a bold color. I mean, you probably don't see this because this is my everyday, but so I'm really kind of natural today. But I really love bold colors like turquoise and purples and blacks and silvers and stuff and greens. So, those are the type of things that I will buy. But I saw this and I thought it was really fat. And it's called tropic and it's kind of like an aquamarine teal but it has like silver flecks in it which is pretty hot um so let me put it on my hand and once again like like sweet like that is hot <laughs> really really fly and you see it's got the shimmer specs on it so like if you use this color with that nyx white shadow primer like the color is gonna be like wow so i might actually even do a look with that this week but that's what i got today um my lovely haul sent me back about a hundred dollars um but this makeup it always fits that's the way i put it so hope this was informational if you guys want to try it check back for my video on the naked and i'll also do one on the